Also on 7, a local artist hoping to get more Floridians access to clean energy. 7's Diana Dia shows us how he's combining science and art to help bring solar power to the Sunshine State. I like the solar energy thing. It's amazing what he's doing. It was cool. I like the effect. 3D effect. These eager students from Jose de Diego Middle School in Miami gathering at the Bakehouse Art Complex to talk about the work of Xavier Cortada. And on this day, the eco artist is unveiling his most unique piece of art to date. <laughs> Actual solar panels have become the canvas for his latest social engagement project, and he's hoping to benefit all Floridians with it. He has combined science with art to help people make sound environmental choices that benefit our planet. As an artist, I paint a lot about nature. I care a lot about nature. And um, I'd rather use this hand to sign a petition than I would to sign my name on a painting. Why? Because a painting represents the beauty of nature. This petition actually brings it to your state. He's teamed up with Floridians for Solar Choice to support efforts to bring more solar power to the Sunshine State. The nonprofit, nonpartisan coalition is actively gathering signatures across the state in order to bring Solar Choice to the people in 2016. Even though, you know, we have the name the Sunshine State and we have all this sunshine year round, we're ranked in the top 10 as far as how much prime sunshine we have. We have all this potential, but less than 1% of our energy is currently coming from solar. And now they're hoping to get the future of our planet on board with their plan. Not only is it just about solar, it's about these local students. It's about creating opportunities for them in the future and really having a sustainable Florida economy and environment. So I'm not going to sit here and paint idyllic sunsets of the Florida Keys. What I'm going to do is try to get Floridians to use the power of the sun to make our state green and beautiful and clean. And so far, it looks like these students are ready to do their part. That instead of using the fossil fuel, we could use um, solar power because we are in the sunshine state. We need to take advantage of that. And the art will be on display tonight from 6 p.m. until 3 a.m. at the Secret Garden Art Walk Experience in Wynwood. In the Plex, I'm Diana Diaz, 7 News.